guys, I will share with you today related fat factor accident listings is the its Valga, land and cabinet. So check it out guys. As you can see guys, this is uh, CCTV. So before you proceed the testing, you need to verify all the drawings, bill of materials. So this is your requirements. You can identify each piece of devices, equipment, what is installed in your FAGA, CCTV, LAN, SDH, and telecom panel so or cabinet so this is all about factory factory acceptance testing so to determine the performance of the tele telephone is the edge panel cctv camera and land system is the edge so what is the range inspections and test procedures will be performed in the presented of subsequent sections so this is the most important while you are doing a factory testing and then before that verifications must be complete any loss connection capacity. wiring uh, yeah. How much the capacity uh, tag the rules to be verified and checked any liter, any missing liter, huh? inform the vendor so that rectifications must be completed and then during the delivery everything must be in place so sometimes the vendor cannot provide uh, cannot close the punch list as soon as possible sometimes we do the closing the punch list during the SAT site acceptance testing so this is all about uh, factory acceptance testing related for all this cabinet so this is uh, how I will check how together with the vendor, technicians and engineers to verify all of these points. So if you can check the panel, the cabinet, check the tag, if all the correct, the breaker itself, all the devices is there, the screw, the earthing, wiring, so verifications of interconnections, drawing, that is the the most important general assembly drawing so meaning when you verify the general assembly drawing so you can easily identify what is missing after that you check your interconnection drawing yes and everything is end-to-end -end connection if if you found any missing then inform the vendor if you want to add more tag so if there is no tag available and some payrolls not not installed missing then advise so that we can so that the vendor we can can rectify about the pants list so that's your pants list something missing so everything is there so as you can see in the video that I captured so I will check all the all the devices fans lights breaker sometimes the breaker for example there is a minor mistake 25 amps as per drawing and then you install 50 amps so you need uh, clarification from the engineering why it's happening because the drawing is showing only 25 amps and then the installations during your inspections 50 amperes so that's to be verified Okay, so this is the basic information for your uh, testing. So this is a uh, vendor testing, factory acceptance testing. So this is the terminal as you can see in the video. So all terminal block, all ferrules, wires, it's the same because 
we need to identify what is the size of the cable cable wires thermo thermostat is working the fan is working the light is working so everything is to be checked as well visual inspection verifications and you need to run all the system okay that is power socket that's uh to supply and then after that all the inspections carried out that's the time we proceed our testing so okay so we can the next uh the next slides you can see there what kind of these things to be carried out during the fat for telecom is the it's and cctv and LAN and server cabinet so everything is in place check check only what is there in the drawing there is a balance missing notify the window okay one thing also guys you need to check the calibrations of the equipment the device either they're using laptop check the laptop and check their calibrator check the test equipment so you need to check all of that so that uh, that will be recorded during your release note when you're releasing the the materials so that's part of your pants list and parts of your report as well so you need to consider all of those uh, materials to be carried out during your inspections during your testing okay so that's the most important thing uh, identify all the materials uh, all the materials all the devices equipment to be utilized during the testing and then the drawings is all IFC drawing are uh, reviewed already and signed by engineering so it's the under that is part of the specifications that's why we come up that drawing everything is uh, signed so that's it don't forget the description model make and serial number calibration date and validity for all those uh, devices and equipments and to be registered in your report as well that is part of your factory acceptance testing report so that's how you can do it so this is the test setup of the camera and then another test setups for your path scored if okay well power test meter this it up as and also part of the procedure and then for your patch cord so check also the patch cord okay ping test that is end-to-end -end test this is how the procedure that uh, needs to do during the testing so output performance of this setup so as you can see internet test setup so this is the photos that uh, you can see clearly what kind of testing is to be carried out during the factory acceptance testing so it's very clear guys uh, if you are not familiar about this testing so you have now an idea what kind of testing is to be carried out okay so that is guys thank you for your watching please like and subscribe and share to your colleagues Check it out in the next upload videos.